what's good, YouTube? I'm Cameron. I'm Zammer. Welcome to Bro Talk. Train, man. Say <laughs> Welcome back to Bro Talk. Special guest with us today, the beautiful Shayla. Come on now. Hi, I'm Shayla. <laughs> I um, run track at JU. Facts. All right, what's the topic we know about this? <laughs> All right, man, so what we're going to talk about today in today's episode is when to make it official. Right. And today we got a girl so we can get her perspective in. Y'all can see what's really going on, man. Question number one is, when do you meet the parents? I got to answer first? Yeah, you can go first. Ladies first. Um, I give it a timeline, I guess, like, maybe the fifth month fifth mark. Fifth month, fifth month. Yeah, when it's, like, getting a little deep. Right, like, when y'all are already yeah. boyfriend and girlfriend? Yeah. Yeah. I wouldn't, yeah, I wouldn't take anybody home if they're not my boyfriend. Facts. That's fair. That's, That's fair. Cool. I agree. I feel like if they not, like... Y'all not on that level, you shouldn't take them home to meet the parents because that's a big deal. You know, that's high level. Yes, yeah, feelings got to be mutual. When y'all ready to meet each other's parents, I think that's when it's a good time. Does it really depend on the person on how close y'all live for y'all to just be like, come meet my parents, man. You know? Yeah. What about like, have y'all had a, like a prom date that wasn't your boyfriend <laughs> and they had to meet your parents? I mean, we don't have boyfriends. Yeah. But, oh. so, <laughs> but I get what you're saying, like, like, you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. A date, you know. Right. In fact, that's it different. Like that. Yeah, that's, that's different. That's happened before, but it was just like weird. Yeah, this ain't yeah. mine. This ain't mine. Significant other is just a friend, you know. Just a date. <laughs> it's just a date. <laughs> They try to make it seem like it's something big or something. Right. That's why you got to be careful. But they be excited, right man. Yeah. Parents be excited about this. <laughs> they do. Exactly. Uh, question number two. What are some qualities you prefer in a boy and a girl? You ain't got to get super deep. You know. You, you can answer first. You know what I mean? That's <laughs> first. Go ahead. Reset the question. Man. Oh, my God. <laughs> Reset the question one more time. What are some qualities you prefer in a girl? <clears throat> I think I speak for all guys when I say this. But I prefer maturity. Maturity got to be like pads with my hand. You know, you got to be mature. If you're immature, I feel like you can't really, you're not ready for a relationship. So it's tough to be with a person who's not mature versus a person that's mature. If you mature, certain things could happen and it would be cool. But if you're immature or insecure, you know what I'm saying? And things like that. Decent. Decent. What do you think, bro? I feel like if the girl, she has to have a quality of loyalness. She has to be loyal. loyalty. You know what I'm saying? She can't be entertaining other guys. She has to be able to. You know what I'm saying? You know, she, she got to be able to just be loyal. Yeah. That, that's, that's what's more important to me. Somebody who don't lie. Somebody who's truthful. Those qualities. That's yeah. with everybody, I think. Yeah, you know, that's fair. So. Um, <laughs> that's some good points. I like that. Yeah, I say, number one, like, God first. That's a big quality for me. Okay. Um, just a gentleman, you know, he's raised right. Manners. Manners. Okay. Yes. Right. Number Absolutely. one. Yeah. No, that's number two. Yeah. Okay. Um, I add on to maturity. That has a lot to do with it. It's a big, it's a big part, man. Because a lot of people are not ready to commit and all that that's stuff. True. Question number three is, what's a deal breaker? To where you just can't make it official with that person. That's, that's a lot of them. <laughs> so, you know, to sum it up for me, it's the vibes. You know, it, it gotta be like the vibe between us. If it's just off, I'm not gonna make it official with you. Just to mm -hmm. be, just to clear it all up. But, yeah, it's a lot of gray areas in that. Uh, I feel like that's why you need to be like friends with the person first before you, yeah. you know, you gotta be friends for a long time before you just be in a relationship with them because deal breakers are, Big man, you know what I'm saying? Like they bigger than just what meets the eye. It's just simple things that can like really end a relationship. Uh, if y'all can't like click, then that's where the problems come in. Uh, that's where y'all bump head on certain topics. You know what I'm saying? Right. Could have went a lot deeper, but okay. You know, that's where it's <laughs> like right now. Okay. What was the question? What's the I deal guess. breaker? A deal breaker. Okay. Where you can't make it official with the person. I would say like if you're forcing it. And it's like they're not meeting you there in the yeah. middle. Yeah. That's one for me. And that mutual. Yes. Yeah, okay. In the talking phase, if something like if you see the red flags and you yeah, still <laughs> you still trying to force facts. it, yeah. That's, what I say. that's what where I say. you gotta just cut it off. Yeah, you got that's why you gotta be friends for a long time first. Cause some yeah. stuff like that can just 
end it. No, that's true. On the flip side of what's what's a deal breaker, this question is what what would what would make you commit to the person? What would make you commit? a lot of them to you wanna go first with that one? One of y'all. No, I would think about it. You're uh first. yeah. Come on. What would make me commit? I think once once we both have put forth the same amount of effort in making this happen, I think that's that's the perfect time. Yeah. To me. I think you should just be over all the games. You gotta be ready to commit. No more single vibes, you know, you gotta do it. Okay, I'm finna marry this person type stuff to be in a relationship. Cause at the end of the day, if it's something temporary, then it, it won't last. But if you're looking at like a lifetime type thing, then like, I feel like it'll last longer. I would say like, if y'all both talk about it and it's mutual right. and y'all have an understanding, that's when you should just like, you should just feel the vibe and just yeah, know right. it's that time. You gotta put a ring on it. Exactly. Like. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta put a ring on it. See, you know when you know when you really like yes. want a person. Especially like you don't like, really have to talk about exactly. y'all. Yeah, like it's a, yeah, you should. It should be an understanding. Like for example, right? You out with your guys. You know what I'm saying? You out with, you out with the boys, <laughs> listening to music, Chris Brown song, come on, uh, Neo, voice the man. You know what I'm saying? Point, and, you, and you should start <laughs> thinking about it when you think about it when y'all out. Oh, you said when you out of body, you think about yeah, her? Yeah, yeah, she just on your mind. Oh, okay. Like, yeah, I got it. You know, and women, like, I know y'all, like, <laughs> y'all work off emotions, you know. And that's, that's true. That's y'all gonna that's show true. it. Y'all gonna show it. Before we do, we exactly, do it. Exactly, yeah. Before we do it. So, that's why I feel like you should just wipe it up when you feel it. Put a ring on it. Right. Exactly. If there's no, like, playing games and stuff, then yeah. I think it could be really obvious. Facts. Okay. And then, like, when you're not messing with nobody else, it's just one person. Yeah, but y'all got to talk about that, though, yeah, too. Yeah, Some people yeah, just be sneaky and they don't talk about exactly. it. Exactly. And that's, that's when it get messed up. Yeah, that's when it get messed up. <laughs> yeah, got to talk. Communication is yeah. key. The last question is, do you ever regret committing to somebody? Have you ever regretted it? <laughs> you know, I'm always, no, hold on. Hold okay, on. go ahead. Because I got, I got a few things to say. How I feel Retreat. about that is, I don't regret none of it because... You live and you learn. It's a learning that's experience. What I, that, that was you know perfect. What I'm it's a learning experience. Well so See, I was gonna say the same thing. Y'all, I don't remember. No, nah, I wasn't gonna say the same thing. <laughs> I, the reason I was gonna but say I agree. that. You agree though? I agree, okay. yeah. The thing is, everything is a lesson. I feel like anytime you're with a person, whether you be with them for a long time, for a year or some change, or you know, three months, you learn something from it. Like, mm. you gotta live and learn. I don't regret none of my relationships. <laughs> I don't regret none of my relationships. I'm glad no, every one of them happened. It Every like one of them taught me something. Yeah, you learned something you know from everything. And it, made, it helped me build the person I am. So, my exes made me. So, my next girlfriend out there, <laughs> thank them. This is the reason I'm like this. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I would say, like, I don't regret it, but I regret holding it for that long. Like, yeah, because you wasting time. Yeah, yeah. Wasting, yeah, like, just wasting my time knowing that it's I not like going to work. I like yeah. that. I regret spending some of the time that yeah, I spent Yeah, because you know when you, you know, should just yeah. cut yeah. something off. And yeah, you, you don't because it's convenient. So. Right, it's prolonging the process. Yes. Yeah. But I definitely learned a lot, yeah, yeah. I'd say. It's a lesson in itself, man. It's like class. Always. I like that. Learn something. I like that. Wasting time always the problem, though. I waste the time. I waste a hell of time. Like, you should just know when you should just yeah. cut somebody See, that's the thing. That's yeah, what I say, like, don't. when you feel it. You just <laughs> yeah, gotta once you feel it, you just gotta, just gotta. Once it's stop. over, listen. When, once it's over, it's over. Don't drag it. Alright, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> that was loud. Alright, y'all. That's the end of the video. I really hope y'all enjoyed it. Yeah, I mean, that's that's it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Um, yeah, it was fun. I appreciate the conversation. Right. Follow me on Instagram, much love yes, underscore Shayla. Yes, sir. It'll be on the screen, man. It'll be in the description below. Yes, sir. <laughs> well, yeah, until the next time, the Bulls twin. I'm say this is bro talk, bro. No, I'm not. <laughs> yeah, this is bro talk.